Good afternoon and welcome to Manitoba, where it is officially win a bank. Must win season has arrived for both of these clubs, entering the match on long winless skids. For Phil Dos Santos, it was a very disappointing Sunday afternoon here in Winnipeg where they conceded twice inside of 10 minutes and could not make the ground back up against York United. From that selection, he makes three changes. For James Merriman and company, a 2-0 loss to Forge last Friday at Starlight Stadium. Needing a bounce back today, they lost Gennaro Daniels to a scary concussion. Positive news built the report that he is in the protocol and is improving by the day. Obviously not ready to go today. So Easton Ungaro will start at the number nine. Well, as mentioned, Josh Hurt playing on the left side today as Reed takes his normal right wing position. And Reed into the box. There's Aparicio. Meets it just in time, but the angle too tight even for someone of many quality and capabilities. But a warning shot. Oh, once again in there, 4 2 3 1. Hates Samaki Pianelli and Bacara left to right. Full with this man today. Mauricio's back in the box, off balance as he shoots. Guillaume Pianelli doing perhaps just enough to throw him off his rhythm, but that's twice now, Will, inside of three and a half minutes, and I think Phil Dos Santos might be having some not-so-pleasant flashbacks. He is in that category, and you and I spoke about this quite a bit last night about players really reaching their ceiling this year, this year as he plays a great ball into a guard. with absolutely no resistance. It has been downhill like an Olympic skiing event, Will, to start this game. Three chances, and for the second match running at home, Valor concede inside of 10 minutes. Goodness me, this is, uh, like you said, it's been chance after chance. And it takes him 15, 20 minutes to get in the game. I've got their mojo. 
Mojo back. Body language from the Winnipeggers says it all. <laughs> it's going to be another long week for these young men, unfortunately. And they'll have to stew over it as they'll have a full week off. They play next Sunday at Vancouver. Here is Selimani going to ground. Demil Gazdov makes the catch. Not Selimani, excuse me, now to Barry. But two games at home where they have failed to show their supporters the fights and the results that they're getting desperate for. As the Winnipeggers lose for a third consecutive match at IG Field, and maybe some time away from Winnipeg will do them wonders. And it's going to have to be. Next up, they take on the bottom ranked team in the CPL. If these were close to must wins, next week is a must win.